give us a few remarks? Because we do want you all to eat because Pastor Chuck is prepared for food and stuff. And we don't want to be in the mosquitoes. Well, thank you, uh, Commissioner Taylor, Commissioner Carson uh, Turner, and uh, his beautiful wife, and, and uh, for all you all that, that invited us out. I do live in Martin County, and I do live uh, born and raised in Stewart. Uh, my actual uh, family moved there in the late 1800s, and uh, oh, you want me to bounce around and jump and talk about football, don't you? <laughs> I'll show, tell you a short story about Carson. The congressman and I were, uh, were on the campaign trail, and we were to meet him at Tiger Stadium, and he said, we're going to look for a young man on the back of a pickup truck, and we, we got there, and there was a deer and a hog dead in the back. And he said, don't worry about that, we're getting ready to go into a game, it was a blue and gold game, and ironically the Tigers in Martin County uh, are also the Fighting Tigers, so that was my introduction to Martin County, there you go. I don't know that we've ever come out here and won, my father said back in the day that uh, you all beat us pretty good, but I did happen to represent this area uh, for, for Tom Rooney, and I came out here a lot. The sheriff at the time was running, and, and we've become great friends, I currently work at the Martin County Sheriff's Office, and I'm out here on my own time and my own dime because of the family generation that I came from was all farming. You see, in Martin County, it was all cut flowers, and it was all citrus. And I can tell you today, there's not one flower farm in Martin County, there's not a flower farm in St. Lucie County, and there's very limited orange groves in that area as well. There was a guy named Bill Becker that hired my father after the flower industry went out the door. And now that you know citrus canker and, and all the other things, my, my dad is one of those gentlemen that get up at 5.30 in the morning and didn't come home till 7 o'clock at night. We contributed to the problem in our river. We contributed to the pesticides that we put in that ground. We all are to blame in this whole game, right? But I can tell you, for working for my best friend Tom Rooney, a congressman that has nothing to do with you, they aren't going to do a damn thing to help us. We are the ones that are going to do it. They are going to help with those South Florida Water Management and the Army Corps. I know that you've been in those meetings with the Army Corps. I know Tom Rooney has been in there, that other boy, the senator, everybody. Right? Every time we get a colonel in the office, honest to God, in this church, Six months later, they leave. They have a better job. We as a community as a whole, I see your shirt say, our lives matter. I'm asking you guys to have all of our communities matter. My community means as much to your community, but I understand exactly what you're going through. The projects that are on the, on the ground right now need to be funded. And there's still some to go, right? You're committed. Congressman Rooney's committed. We need to band together. I would ask in this restoration of the glades, in the meetings that I hope that you continue to have, and Commissioner Taylor, I will personally come to those, whether it's Okeechobee or it's Moorhaven, it doesn't matter where it is. We have emotions going on over there just like you do. And I'd be damned if I was you too, for them to take your land or take your property. But if somebody wants to sell the land and somebody wants to give it up, then so be it. But you do need to stand strong. Because my whole family, the whole farming industry was gone, and I had to pick another career. So you said earlier a louder voice, Pastor, and one voice. I'm, I'm extending my hand for Martin County out to you all, those in Okeechobee, to be one. To go to those meetings in Tallahassee and Washington, and be one voice, and be one clear message. Your community isn't any different than mine. And I don't put any clothes on, I put them on the same way you do, Carson, right? I don't live in a better community than you all do. I actually like coming out here. The Swamp Cabbage Festival is one of my favorite. And to have Tom Rooney, a boy who everybody always says was privileged with a gold spoon, to see him come out and go to Carson's house, has horses walking through the middle of it, the Great Danes, <laughs> and to make him feel so, un so awkward it, it's a real community. It's, it's home. And I can tell you, as, as my father said, and, and many of you, we're, we're not going to give up anything. I'm here as, as like I said, a, a seventh generation. My son's eighth generation Floridian. Those people that have moved in my community and your community have been here 10, 15 years. And I'm proud to come from a farming background. And I know you are as well. And you need to stand behind it. But I can tell you just as much as Roland Martin's 
marina and our marina's over there. We just did a project, Carson's on Facebook with it. Me and two other people funded the cleanup of a marina that had 12 to 16 inches of, of algae in it. It's almost five and a half, 500 tons of algae if you pulled it out. We cleaned it on our own dime in a week and we put that marina back to work and we put the community in that area. You, you saw it, Ecosphere. They were able to breathe, they were able to function, they were able to put boats back in the water for any season. We as a community did that, and you as a community need to continue to be loud and be proud, and more importantly, join us as one. And I think everybody together, beating the same drum, not different drums, and I don't know if I was clear earlier, I don't represent a group, I don't represent anybody other than myself and my family. And I'm here to help and join with you all Thank you for having us. Thank you for allowing me to speak, Congressman. Thank you so much. Thank you for your staff and the continued efforts that the projects that are currently underway that we continue to fund, it, it, it has to happen. Unite with us, and, and Commissioner Taylor, I'm here to partner with you, as I said earlier, so thank you.